Hey, this is Dave Gleason, head coach at Athletic Revolution in Pembroke, Massachusetts. Uh, listen, last night actually, uh, I was searching YouTube and Google uh, just to see what was out there these days in terms of youth fitness videos. And much to my surprise, there was a ton of content. So many videos from trainers and coaches all over the world, really. Um, some of them were just so awe-inspiring and so, uh, so impressive, really. But at the same time, I couldn't, uh, I couldn't help but think, I feel like the, a lot of these people are just showing off their young athletes in terms of, you know, look at what tricks my kids can do. Can your kids do these tricks? Uh, or if to say, if your son or daughter comes to my facility and trains with me, they too will be able to do these tricks. Um, that's all fine and well, but um, I just have a question in terms of the programming because we don't really see that uh, too much in terms of youth fitness videos. What kind of programming? How do these athletes get from A, or where they started from, to where they are now? And are they practicing this single exercise, this single activity, over and over and over and over again, developing all this really, or not developing really anything, but just through repetitive motion, learning a single skill? Um, from the age of six, or even a little bit younger, all the way up through 18 years old, a child really needs to have a broad base and as many different looks at physical activity to increase their athleticism overall as humanly possible. Now I learned all this through the International Youth Conditioning Association. Um, so if you'd like to learn more in terms of you know, what you can do to broaden your fitness programs for kids, or for your own children, ideas to get. Uh, there's so much content. Just go to iyca.org and you find out everything right there. Thanks so much.